I sat down and wrote a letter to everyone who's calling this country home. Dear Pakistan, I'm standing here looking back and preparing to take my last step before I'm leaving. I had 30 days to get to know you and I couldn't be more heartbroken right now. Every single day was a new day filled with unexpected experiences and moments I will never forget. The only and true thing I want to say is thank you. You taught me the biggest lesson of my life that we as humans have to stand together. My time here was so intense that it took all my energy away, but I feel like it was kind of needed. Thank you for being kind, generous and truly, truly welcoming. You protected me when I never asked for it. And most importantly, you gave me the chance to really get to know you. My biggest passion is without any doubt traveling and making videos because it's the only way that allows me to keep my memories forever. I always try to improve my filmmaking skills with the help of the World Wide Web. Today's video is sponsored by Skillshare and I'm so 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 excited because it's my favorite platform out there. Skillshare is an online learning community where you can basically learn any skill you want. They have thousands of topics and courses around filmmaking, photography, design, marketing and much much more. My biggest goal for 2020 is to become a better filmmaker and storyteller. So every single day I'm trying to learn something new and at the moment I'm taking a class on how to film transitions and how to edit them together. You can really learn anything there in any creative space. For example, you can learn how to design your bedroom or how to make a good documentary, like everything. Click the link in the description box to get two free months of premium membership to explore your full creativity. It's for free, so I would like to click on it. For me, it's one of the most valuable websites out there and I believe that everybody can achieve something great if you really want it. Also, it's really affordable because you get two months for free and if you decide to continue, an annual subscription is only 10 bucks a month. Just take your chance as long as it's there. You have nothing to lose. <laughs> I spent my last days in Pakistan exploring the mountain area around Hunza. Drink a little water, feel a little better. You do what you gotta, babe. We Bring life into your muscles, instinct for. So I just arrived to Hunza. I said goodbye to everybody, unfortunately. So it seems that I will be alone uh, the next few days but there's one thing i learned you are never alone in pakistan who are you <laughs> so i met a fellow video maker and his bike crew We're driving on the left side yeah, of the road, yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> Just like you, you as the driver have to be can, in the middle of the road. Can you see if there's something coming? No, nothing. Just go. Go with the flow. What's your name? Are you use, okay? Bing. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tell me, what's your name? Why? What's your name? Oh, Toby, Toby, what's his name? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Look, everybody you can have such an awesome shell. <laughs> My name is Michelle. <laughs> What's your job? I'm a makeup artist. <laughs> Don't laugh. <laughs> Toby, what's your job? I'm a bus driver. <laughs> uh, we are at uh, Gulmet right now and we'll be going to a vantage point up on a hill. It's going to be off road, but it is worth it. You'll have Pasu on the left and on the right, it's Atabar Lake. Yeah. We came up the hill to a uh, 
beautiful view from up here. <laughs> Camera! Action! Oh, action. Roll. action! Silence, please! <laughs> so, this is Amadai. Uh, let me introduce you. And he got an idea, they have a lot of apricot trees in Hamza. So, he got an idea, okay, let's make apricot cake. So, he's the first one to start this apricot cake over here. And his apricot cake is the best over here. The most is Very nice. We can watch yeah. it. Yeah, so this is the legend over here. And uh, he's the chef. Fantastic. Fantastic. And then happened what I call overwhelming hospitality. I simply looked for a toilet and this family insisted to treat us for lunch and homemade food. They live on their own farm which is totally self-sustainable. And it was just a beautiful place. Take us with you to sauce. I shouldn't forget it, okay? On the next day, my visa was about to end, and I challenged myself one last time hitchhiking in Pakistan. It literally took five seconds until someone stopped. That's it. That was my time in Pakistan and I just want to say one last thing at the end of this video. There's no reason not to come to Pakistan. Even as solo female traveler like me, I always felt safe and I had one of my best times here and as you could see I was never alone. This might be my last Pakistan video for now but I know for sure that this was my last time visiting this amazing place. I simply want everybody to go there and experience the same good things I experienced.